Hi everybody, welcome back to Stalker, and I know who the last one is that we want to bring with us. It's actually one of the, uh, the guy, the monolith guy. I totally forgot about him. Uh, so that's gonna be our fourth guy, and that's it. We're ready to go underground. Uh, no other reason to do anything else. What I will likely do, though, is I will take my shotgun rather than this thing. I wish I had a better shotgun, but, uh, I, you know, beggars can't be choosers. I'll see what other guns I have, but we want to bring out the best of our best. Hey, and well met. The sniper rifle is definitely one I want to bring because I've, me, me, me and him have had a very good time together. Uh, well, we got the MG. Um, yeah, I'm a bet. I'm a fan of the shotgun. I wish we had an automatic shotgun, kind of, but it will do okay. And we're actually gonna bring some of the slugs with us this time. All right. Is there... As much as that SMG was good, it's still a meme, so... And we don't need this much fucking side block and radio protectant, but however, it weighs like practically nothing, so... What is the thing that's weighing so much in my inventory right now? Is it this thing? No? There is something that weighs like a shit ton. And I have absolutely no idea what it is. Uh, grenade. Oh, grenades also weigh a bit in the into radiation. Maybe we'll sell some of that away. We should also bring uh, a pretty good amount of food with us as well. Um, we'll just sell like seven meter meter kill radius is the ones we want. I could say that's so weird, isn't it? Like fucking like I know the rifle weighs a lot, and I know this thing weighs a lot. But that accounts for 17. Oh, it must be all the ammunition. Let me see right here. I'm not actually selling it. Yeah, the ammunition weighs a little bit too. Actually, the ammo is heavy as fuck. <laughs> oh boy. All right. Yeah. Um, let's just bring. Some, let's buy some more sausages. And uh, let's go talk to the good old doctor here, because the doctor will want to buy some of the stuff I want. I need medical assistance. Will you go to appropriate with me? No, you won't. Alright, um, we don't need all this fucking garbage. Side block. I mean, I don't think these are a huge issue, but... I ne I don't use these. I really don't. Uh, what's this one? Radiation protection. We'll carry a couple of those. And some bandages we'll get rid of. Like, this should be enough med kits and everything. Alright, let's go find uh, the last guy. Is this him? Uh, no. This is, uh, I think, the... Yeah, no, this is the Freedom Guys. Um, you know anyone who'd be going to... Uh, Pripyat? Yeah, Strider, one of our new recruits. He feels uneasy in the ranks. Uh, but he's not happy here. Okay. Is this Strider? Uh, no, it's Armor. No, that's Walrus. Sickle. Oh, here's... This is Strider. Oh, man. We're putting a squad together, will you join us? Yeah, I'll go with you. I want, I want to know what happens to us. Yeah, my fingers crossed that we'll find the answer to the question in Pripyat. I have to warn Loke, but I doubt he'll object. Alright, you'll need a close suit respiratory module to get to Pripyat. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I kept my monolith armor and it, it comes with exactly that. The problem is, I can't be seen wearing it at Yanov. Alright, well, let's go to Zulu. Hope he's not going to shoot when he sees my old armor. We need to pick it up on the way and return the one I'm wearing. Let's go. All right. What's up? Leader achievement because I got all f I got four people now. Uh, wow, monolith armor. Where where the hell did you get that? It was part of a set. This stri this is Strider, former monolith fighter. I didn't realize there were former monolith fighters. Um, oh, well, we'll see what he's like when the real shit starts. By the way, for anyone who doesn't know who what the monolith are, they're people who are basically like kind of taken over psionically or whatever by the brain scorcher and they fought for um they basically fought against stalkers and killed stalkers and so like there was no one that was really former it's only when the brain scorcher went down that they apparently came back or whatever uh what do you think about strider mindless people are usually tactical fierce fighters i'm sure about the former not sure about the former members of those try to look calm on the outside but Appearances can be deceiving. Okay, save it. Sure, you know what? I'll do one one better. Give it a hard save, actually. 
And guess what? We got enough people, we can move out. Good, let's roll, folks. Let's go. So we got ourselves our shotgun, we got our rifle, and we're going to Pripyat. Apparently we're going in the middle of the night. There we go. That's better. Okay, apparently one of those guys just doesn't want to wear a closed respiratory module. Suit? Like, why? Good to go. Ready. What? I'm always ready. Also, ready. I have a bad feeling about this. Everyone's ready. Open it up. Roger. Let's rock. That's good. Go. Good luck, boys. So I'm the asshole without the helmet. Alright guys, welcome to the underpass. This is honestly one of the cooler parts of the game right now. Great, just great. So this guy has a AKU. This guy is using I don't know what the fuck that is. This guy has a machine gun, and I think one of them had a sniper. Oh my god, none of them have a sniper. What well, a mess. Who's the guy with the rifle? Of this kind of thing at our base. I'm so glad you can see them, because I can't see shit, son. So we kind of don't want to lose anybody, but someone already got hit. Shit, let me get that one. They fucking killed me! <laughs> oh... Yeah, hopefully these assholes don't shoot me again. They have fucking weapons. The, the, the thing we really have to worry about is ourselves, you know? Bleeding slightly. Okay, I think you got him. Alright, we got our Press objective button, log. Bro. We must open the gate to keep going. What a place. Okay, this is utterly useless. At least the protected field will be from you. Well. What the fuck are you shooting at? Let's give it a good save here. It's the worst squad ever. And this is why we have the closed respiratory cycle suits. Whoa, there's an anomaly here. Let's see if there's a way of getting through. Huh. Well, I have a nice detector for that. Come. I found the way through. Yeah, I have the same thing, asshole. You're not fucking special. Oh, nice and dark. Yeah. 
Looks like the direct route is not an option. Yeah, I guess not. No worries. Real men often take the back door. Did he just say real men often take the back door? <laughs> door blocked. Got him. Wait, who the fuck just bled? The fuck? Keep, you must open the door to keep going. He is fucking stacking up right here. Something doesn't feel right. Hearing something, but I don't know where it is. Behind us? Yeah, it is. Uh -oh. oh, fuck this shit. I'm fucking dead. I wish I had an automatic shotgun, to be honest. I probably should have looked a little bit harder for something like that. Because that one's, that one's not very good. Oh, he came up from, from up there this time. Shit. Okay, we got him. I'm gonna just lob a grenade somewhere here. Take out. Open. You know, you know, I just want to mention that my my fi my face still shows, like when I die. I just noticed. That like I'm I'm actually not wearing a closed respiratory suit right now, according to the game's model. What the fuck is that guy doing behind the wall? Okay, looks like everyone's still alive somehow. It's fucking ragtag bit of misfits we have going on here. Okay, well, I heard a bunch of dialogue after I died there. It's actually pretty difficult. You know what? I've just decided we're we're switching to the slugs. One slug? Wait. Oh, no, it's eight. Okay, I don't know why. I just loaded, like, one shot. I think the slugs will be better. Fuck. It's not better at all. Shit. Well, bro, let's rock and roll. Something feels wrong here, too. I mean the fucking noxious gases that are in the area? I see some guys in there, but it's useless.
couple of little things here. Maybe I'll go back to check it. Holy shit, can you guys fucking stop? Like, it's right beside my ear, holy shit. You know, I don't remember this being this place being so fucking dark, actually. Oh my god, it's because we went at night for this shit. Because there, there's actually, you see that? That's a skylight. So we literally are here at night. Uh, good fucking times. All right. Another anomaly. Let's see. Hmm. Go this way once, it may be a lot. Man, I'll just go through it. It's fine. There's an artifact here or something. Okay. There's a way through here. Let's hope it leads somewhere a little less deadly. Let me check out what's over here. Oh, we got another jellyfish? We totally did, which means if we had the a suit upgrade where it had like three, then we'd have a... be able to use this uh, Heart of the Oasis, but... As it stands, we can't do that. Okay, we're definitely gonna need to bring that, uh, the booze with us. What are these guys doing? We still have all four. Uh, so that's pretty good. Alright. Let me have a look around here. Well, we have a door right here. This door is not being powered. The power to the gate has been cut. There's been a power cut. Haha. <laughs> so we gotta figure out what to do with that. Pretty sure it's that control room that's up there that you see, kind of, with the... the lights. Well, I'm gonna just have a quick look around. This door is not being powered. Why are these assholes following me around? No, like, really. Why? It's kind of roaming around now. I'm sure they have it. That That's a pleasant screeching noise, by the way. It's a non-threatening one. Oh, there's something over here. Oh, there's some uh, Starker Energy drinks and a 9mm suppressor. I'm just having a look around right now, and the guys are all following me around, so... Uh, alright. Now to figure out... Okay, there's a ladder here. So, that might be a clue. Hey, you be careful with that thing, alright? This looks like a transformer. I wonder if all the lines have been activated. Back to back, quickly. All right. Vano is dead. Vano dead. Zulu has been killed. Yeah, uh, I don't know if I can keep them all alive. You know what, let's let's load it back actually before I do that. So we basically got attacked by something, and it's a quite unfortunate that we're doing this in the middle of the night, because if I had known... Yeah, because I, I, I can't see anything and the AI will cheat then. Fuck, you see, I like, I can't snipe anything. Oh, here we go. Pretty sure they're here, though. I'm fucking dead. Yeah, we just can't see shit. I'm wondering if I should just, like, idle in the game for, like... You know, I might try and do that. I might try and idle in the game until the day-night cycle changes. Because I actually kind of wish I didn't do this. Because you can see that the time is actually changing slowly. It'll just take, like... 
probably about half an hour for it to go into full daylight mode. Yeah, see, like, it, the minutes pass slowly, but they do pass. Um, I don't know. I may actually do that, so you know what, guys? Uh, I'll just cut it and the scene a little bit. So, I'm doing pretty good now. I gotta just eat stuff, because I waited around for a bunch of hours. Uh, as you can see, it's uh, 10 a.m. now. And now we can definitely get this shit going. It's one. These guys are fucking deadly, though. So they're basically monolith fighters. Is that all of them? Shit, don't kill me. Alright, it's uh... Okay, apparently just gonna jump down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what they have there for loot, though. Uh, we're trying to keep everyone alive, so uh, you're gonna have to forgive me. I'm gonna be doing a shit ton of saving and loading. What's this one? This is new. Next generation model of the AK, AK series. Okay, that's not so bad. Kinda neat. Good thing I decided to follow you. That's actually pretty fucking awesome. But we're using the our good old Remington 870. Remington, those engines, guys. Or fryers, sorry, that's the meme. Uh, what's this gun? Okay, that's a piece of shit. This is also a piece of shit. However, this man has some food on him. Here, just unload, put that there. Actually, this is different. This is AK, AEK, but we don't want that either. I'm kind of sad that I just used up all my grenades. I only brought two with me, and I didn't quite think that through, you know? Like, maybe that wasn't such a good idea to just bring two grenades, but you know. Because I totally knew this was coming, by the way. You guys want to, like, not fucking hump me? But fortunately enough, it's actually, like, kind of reasonable now for us to actually see what the fuck we're doing, so... What is the deal with this place? What the hell? Is there stuff up there? There's RPGs here. What do you know? You know, that would have been a good weapon to bring along. kind of have a peek up here. So yeah, we got ambushed by them, so it's like, whatever. I mean, something is highly suspicious about this area, or maybe not, I don't know. Do we turn on the power? What the hell? I think I may have been here at some point. <laughs> I'm not sure. That's, that's the guy who was taken over by the, uh, by the, uh, uh, he, he was, he's the ex-monolith guy, whoops. All right, let's check out what's in here. Well, there's some help. Moving, bro. I've got your back. I think that means that they're not coming with me. Oh no, they are coming with me. Look, it's open now. Yeah, nice guys. Actually, what the hell does this this thing go to? Oh, nothing. It just simply exists. So rule of thumb is, don't go in the middle of the fucking night to go into Pripyat. That's a really bad idea. Careful. Something is wrong here. Oh, the snipers. They're mine. Whoa. They're toast. Okay. Is that it? Well, the way is clear. Let's go. No point standing around here, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, that's definitely a guy. Oh. 
I fucking shot, too. I totally did, but yeah, this is not like a, a wonderful sniper roost anyways. <laughs> Trying to figure them out. I know there's one over here. Actually, he's been shot. Let's try to see if there's anyone else here. It's nice that it's actually somewhat daylight, because now you can kind of make out things. Okay, I think they killed them. Get back downstairs. I thought there would be snipers or something. But, you know, times have change. Alright. Let's get going then. So monoliths are defending this place, so that's a interesting little detail. I want to go to where the monolith spawned from or whatever. And he's got a sketch and APS. I don't know, guys. That guy, that weapon seems a bit. Whoa, shit! I was gonna make a joke saying it was kind of sketchy, but okay. Apparently, this guy was just waiting to ambush us. That's completely empty. Oh, this guy's another grenade for me. Thank fuck. Actually, we're getting really full on our inventory. It's because we're taking a long. A lot of weapons here, like the A key, uh, the A key. Yeah, we're taking along the A key. Alright, <sighs> let's get going, let's get the fuck out. I'm getting sick and tired of this under Pripyat underground shit. Okay, two up where'd the bodies go? The fuck? There's no bodies here. And I know I saw one from the other place. It's a definite anomaly, I would say. Yeah, look who's right. Okay, let's move. I'll go first and like, you know, set up all the traps. Let's bring the rifle out with minimum scope. So I can do quick shots for my montage. Is everyone accounted for? One, two, three, four. Yes, we are doing good. Reach and clear, motherfuckers. I'm getting a and not the good kind. It's motherfuckers' feelings, I swear. Uh, well, he's got some goodies for me. The hell with this place. I can't wait till I'm out of here. This is like 90 times better, just because like we can actually see what the fuck we're doing. Do we have slugs in this thing? Yeah, I think we do. Oh my... Oh my god, no, I don't want to stand in front of this. I don't even know what these guys are shooting at, but... No! I, I, I can actually see the gunshots coming. My life flashing before my eyes. Alright. We gotta have a look to see if there's anything down here. Whatever, there's nothing here. It's a good thing I decided to follow you. How else would I have seen a place like this? Yeah, I think you said that before.
Can we just shoot the one in front of me? Alright, we can actually we'll just take all of that. I don't even know why I'm uh, micromanaging half this shit. I think it makes me feel good on the inside. Alright, this guy has an AK-105. He's got a shotgun. No, as I particularly want. Uh, this one, I'll take everything but the pistol. I'm not even going to take the vodka. There's also a box here. Full of uh, NATO ammo and a 939. Okay, well, might as well take them all. But we are getting kind of full on our inventory situation here. I don't even know it's taking up this much room. But, I mean, we don't have to run anywhere, so... We'll just leave it be for now. I really should make some sort of, like, minimalistic loadout. What are you shooting at? Oh. Things over there. Just zoom in slightly. Is there a guy over here? That guy has a that guy has like a power suit. What the fuck? My gut feeling is that we've made it. Got feeling my ass. Now I don't know why, like he's wearing a suit. Just take it fucking off him. It's better than like whatever piece of shit I'm wearing. Okay. This is some more zombie stalkers, but they all have goodies. Gut feeling says they made it. Oh, there's a ladder here. That took fucking forever. Holy shit. Put your weapons on the ground, now! Don't shoot! I'm Lieutenant Sokolov, co-pilot of Stingray 4. I'm on my way to B-28, the emergency position. I have information for Kowalski. Take me to him. You know Kowalski? Who are you? What's your business with the commander? I'm Major Degtyrev, USS. I'm here to investigate the failure of Operation Fairway. USS? What the...? I knew it. You're a merry gang, ain't you? What do you think? We're here for fun? Why so trigger-happy? Can't you see that we're all friends here? Me and Agent d d have been through a lot. Trust me on that. Okay. Follow me. I'm not going. I have no business with the army. Or the USS. Hold it. Let him go, Captain. Fine. Screw him. And I don't give a rat's ass who's working for who.
Greetings, I am Colonel Skolzwalski, the commander of this unit. I'm Major Mike Lott. I'm authorized to investigate the failure of Operation Fairway. I see, listen up, Major. Opera uh, Major, Operation Fairway went down the pen together with the choppers. Half my boys are dead and we ain't got comms with HQ. I want to know why the operation failed as much as you do. Any ideas? Uh, my only idea is that the helicopters were shot down. Shot down using an extremely powerful weapon we don't know much about. Monolith fighters we used one against us during the first assault on CNPP. I'm planning to capture one of those weapons and investigate. If you want in on the action, the monolith squad carrying this weapon has been tracked down. And the assault team is waiting uh, for my signal to start the operation. What do you say? I agree on the condition you provide me with all the information you've gotten and give me complete freedom of action. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, of course, Major. Given the circumstances, I don't have much of a choice. By the way, go see L L Lieutenant Kurlov. He'll issue you some equipment. Alright. Bye. Let's go talk to the, the Krill. So, we're welcome to our new place. Uh, we have one tech guy here. I'm trying to see where my uh, new stash is. I really wish the stash did move from place to place, but just whatever, I guess. Where the fuck is, uh... I think it's like a floor below us. I heard this. Do I need to put some of this shit away? Oh my fucking god. This is the time you decide to go up the stairs, you fucking dickhead. Alright. Uh, stash is somewhere... here. Oh, there it is, I think. Yeah, there you go. Personal locker. I'll put all this away. So there's a couple of good good ammunition types and some good weapons here. There's also one guy who will be able to repair stuff. And of course, as it is tradition in Russia, when you go to a new place, um, you bring out your fucking guitar and just chillax. Actually, I don't know. Can I sell anything to anyone here? Alright, is this Krilov guy? He's Tarasov, uh, Captain Kar Tarasov. You may be a major, but I'm in command here, and that means my orders are not up for discussion. Uh, the lives of every man in the squad depend upon that. The plan is as follows: we go into, we get into position and in the western section of the hospital and wait for the monolith forces to show up. We have to work quickly to make sure we don't attract unnecessary attention. I'm not ready yet. Come on, the monolith people won't wake. Bye. No, fuck off. Vena, what's up, friend? Okay. You'd better ask the captain. You'd better ask the captain. I think I'd better ask the captain. Alright, I think we gotta figure out who is the person to talk to here to sell things, because that's pretty important. The commander can answer your question. And where's the guy who does like the the other stuff? I'm honestly trying to figure out what the fuck we're doing here, so... What is this place? Oh, it's a door. The commander, shit. I don't want to be here. Okay, I'm pretty sure that all the people that I need are downstairs. Like, I can see them on my minimap, but I can't, I can't actually really tell where they are. Exactly. See, this isn't the medic- see, the medic guy is, like, through this wall. Either on the first or second floor. Okay, maybe he's over here. Alright, what's he want? Uh, you got any ammo? Yeah, he broke into the monolith warehouse the other day and it was full of every type of ammo in the zone. Alright. Wonder how, how much you get... How, I wonder how they get so much weaponry in here. I guess other per perimeter guards must be selling them. Can you repair my shooters too? Of course. Repair all kinds of weapons. Alright, I need body armor. Uh, he's gonna give me a ballot armored suit and sphere 12 helmet. Alright, here's the helmet to start with and now armor. Hope it's your size because you don't have any other size anyways. It's patched up and should hold up. Need ammo? What do you need? Oh, I can give. I can ask for any kind of ammo I want. Uh, okay, forget about it. I need grenades. Um, kind of need some hand, hand grenades. All right, here. And let's see. What, what what can he do? So he can only repair things. He can't actually um, can't do anything else really with that. Like he can't upgrade the suit or anything. But we have the Sphere Twelve helmet. That's kind of- this has like the best impact negation I think we can get right now. 
So I think we're going to put that on, actually. We don't need this suit anymore, I think, for the time being. I'm too overloaded to move, because now my max is 50 kilograms. What is taking up all that space? Who knows? I think we can... I need medical supplies, I need medical assistance. Okay, he's just going to give me a bunch of shit. Okay, he's healthy. Um... So, is there no one to sell anything to, is the question. Try to look on the map. So the two people I talk to are not people I can sell things to. Let me just go with that. They're not vendors. Uh, so that's my lock. That's the bed. Okay, so I think I've determined that there's absolutely no reason for me to bring anything back anymore. Uh, in fact, I can just drop most of this shit, so... Or, like, just eat, like, a ton of bread, you know? Why not? Yeah, fuck you, too. Yeah, you asshole. We don't have any slots for uh, artifacts here. I'm not really using them anyways, like, not in, like, a good way manner anyways, so... I'm actually okay with just putting them back in here. A 9mm suppressor... Uh, put some health kits back. We didn't really use any of the really good ones, to be honest. And I think we're good. What is weighing this much? I actually need to know. Can't be all my sausages. Oh yes, I'm at I'm at 50 kilograms. Yeah, that's fucking hilarious. It is honestly, is it honestly a suit? <coughs> Can't be just a suit. Okay, some of the ammo is taking up a lot of space, and I think some of the energy drinks. Oh, and also this food. Okay, it's not as bad, but it's still pretty bad. But we really need we really need this because it's like uh, we're gonna be in some shit in a minute. Trust me. I think these grenades weigh a lot too. I got this shit. It's like two of these are a kilogram. I don't know, this is good enough for now, I guess. Let's see, what do I have? Okay, I mean, I'm wearing the army suit now. Alright, you know what, we're gonna leave it off here, guys. Uh, so, take care, everyone, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.